हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड मैं संजय अग्रवाल एक्सप्लेन टू यू अबाउट व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ द फ्रीक्वेंसी शिफ्टिंग के एएस के एएस के एंड एफएस के अंदर सो बेसिकली दिस सेक्शन इज योर इनपुट सेक्शन दिस आर द बेसिक वेरियस स्विच 8 बिट स्विचेस वी हैव सेट इट टू 10101010 दिस विल बी योर इनपुट टू द मॉड्यूलेटर वी हैव कैरियर फ्रीक्वेंसीज ऑफ 640 किलो हर्ट्ज फ्रॉम दिस साइड एंड 320 किलो हर्ट्ज फ्रॉम दिस साइड This is the 620 kilohertz. This is the 640 kilohertz. Although on the CRO you won't get exact 640, the, we observed 6666 for this kilo and 3333 for this. The basic difference is like this. This frequency should be double of this frequency. That is, should be more. Now coming over here, this is your NRZ bar. That is that will be the complement of this input which you are giving, and this is the NRZ which will be the exact replica of this input. So as you can see over here. This we have connected the NRZ bar, so we are getting zero one zero one zero one respectively. And since we have connected the second probe to ASK one, this is this is your ASK one, and this is your ASK two. The ASK one will represent the ASK one will represent higher voltages for. Uh, as you can see over here, we have replaced it from NRZ bar to NRZ the input, and this will be the ASK one, and this is your ASK two. ASK one will give you high frequency for one and low frequency for zero, whereas ASK two will give you high frequency for one and low frequency for zero. So since we have connected this output to ASK one, you can observe high frequency for one and low frequency for zero. This is your ASK one. Now changing the Uh, probe to ASK2. We are getting high frequency for zero and low frequency for one. Pause. Now what you have to measure is the carrier frequency. As we, uh, as I said that we got 666 for this, triple 6.66 kilohertz for this. So let's measure that. Over there. This is our carrier one single four modulator. This the frequency of this has been measured was triple six point six six kilohertz, and the low frequency which we measured from this side, this is triple three point three three kilohertz. So the difference between those two, like three 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 point three into two is six six six. That should be the difference. Now measuring the FSK signal, you have to connect this probe to this FSK output signal. Now as you can see, now as you can see. Uh, You will be getting high frequency for one, low frequency for zero. This is the this is the this is the FSK signal which we were expecting. Now let's move on to the uh, now this.